Hey guys, in this video, um, I'm going to speak to you from the heart. I mean, I'm going to speak to you real talk now. So some of you might not like like me talking to you like this, but I'm going to talk to you for real. And it has nothing to do with Top Step and has nothing to do with whatever you think it has to do. Guys, I am so disgusted by over leveraging now and by and by gambling that I, the idea of even gambling now I get no high from gambling none I used to those days are over I am disgusted with over leveraging I have guys I'm just gonna lay it out to you I'm a very skilled day trader when I am not over leveraging it is the one thing that is holding me back from becoming a professional day trader and that is putting on too much size and let me tell you something guys the Nasdaq can move 300 to 600 points in a day and it regularly does that if you have to go down to the micro Nasdaq I'm gonna live in the micro Nasdaq now I'm done with the mini why because I am so tired of gambling and so tired of over leveraging that I'm physically revolted I am physically disgusted by over leveraging it is the one thing that is holding me back from consistent returns over time. Okay? I know that. All right? There's no doubt in my mind. You've seen my executions. I've shown you uh, photographs. I've shown you when I'm, when I'm trading well. And, and you see that the fair value gaps and the order blocks and the macros, you see that they work. But why am I still not making money? Because I fucking blow it over leveraging. And I'm pissed. Why do I do that to myself? Why do I put on too many contracts? I know what I have to do. It's not, it's not a secret. I have to trade the micro NASDAQ and I have to trade small. That's it. And just make returns over time. And I just refuse to do that. I thought that one mini, guys, I thought that one mini NASDAQ was, you know, good proper leveraging on this, on this top step account. It's not, guys. It's not. It's, it's micros. You think that $3,000 of loss limit is a lot. Guys, it's not. It's not. It's not. And it's not. $3,000 is not a lot of money. It's not. Not in this realm. Okay? And so I'm done with the full-size NASDAQ. I'm done. I'm done. Because I'm not blowing out my accounts. I'm not. I will, I will, I will freaking milk this account to the very last penny. I will I will milk this bitch until it is done. And I'm not over leveraging anymore because I'm physically about to vomit from what I have done to myself. I am a damn good day trader, y'all. You see that? That's why you subscribe to me. So when I come to you and I say, yes, I know I can do this. I know I can do this. I lo I've recently lost about 20 pounds, guys. I mean, look at my older videos. You will see that I have lost weight. I've I've transformed my diet. I've transformed my habits. I I've become so much more knowledgeable on the market. I'm not, and and I'm just not there, because I put on too much size. I put on too much size. And and I understand y'all are not used to seeing me very emotional. And I get that, guys. But. It's, it's, it's so true, guys. Most of you, if you're working like a normal job, you're making fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollars $70,000 a year. That's about 200 to $250 a day. Let's say you make $80,000 a year. It's about $350 a day. Guys, on just a couple of micro NASDAQs, you can, a couple of MNQ, like one or two, micro NASDAQs, one-tenth the size of the mini, you can make more than most of your jobs, your day jobs, your coffee shops. If, if many of you are working, guys, I'm an attorney and I can make way more money trading the micro NASDAQ than most new entry level associate positions and, and really not with even that much size. Guys, it's not even close. The scale of the amount of money and income that you can make from day trading in comparison to most jobs, even up in surgeon, doctor, I'm an attorney, even up to attorney level, guys, it's not... It's not even close when you get when you get good at this, um, but you you got to treat it the right way, guys. It's going to start small. It's going to start small, and there's nothing wrong with trading the micros. Nothing, guys. If you make two hundred dollars in a day, that's a beautiful day. 
That's a great day. That's a really good day. $200, $300. It's not a bad day at all. So why are you worrying about trading the minis? Why are you worrying about putting on so much size? It doesn't matter, guys. You've got to put things in perspective about how much money this really is over time. It's a lot, especially when you get good. And I'm sorry to just put it all out there on y'all like this. I'm not usually such an emotional guy, but this is really coming from the heart. I know what I'm doing wrong. I am putting on too much size. I should not be trading the minis. Even on $3,000 of drawdown, guys, it's not as much as you think. It's really not. You can easily blow through $3,000. Let me be a cautionary tale, guys. Don't make the same mistakes that I've done. Do not gamble. Do not over leverage. Trade the micro NASDAQ, okay? You don't need to trade the full size NASDAQ. Scale up the micro NASDAQ. Does it make me a little bit upset that, that Top Step does not have a mini to micro equivalent? Yeah, I think that Top Step, look, I'm going to be honest with you, Top Step. If I can trade two minis, I should be able to trade 20 micros. I mean, they're the same thing, Top Step. That's kind of silly. Um, that's the one thing I really don't like about what Top Step does. I'm sorry. I'm not disparaging the company. I'm telling you my opinion. In my opinion, the fact that you cannot trade the equal, equivalent number of micros is quite upsetting. Uh, I can't believe that they haven't implemented that feature yet, but whatever. It's not, it's not my company. Um, in any event, guys, over leveraging will end you. It will end you as a day trader very quickly. Guys, the micro NASDAQ is enough. The NASDAQ moved over 330 points today, and guys, it can do 600 points. It can do 700 points. We haven't had a 600-point day in quite a bit of time, but believe me, it can happen. That's a limit down day, and yeah, it can happen. 600, 650 points. So you got to be prepared for those big days, guys, and they can't blow out your account. That's why you have to trade the micros, because you don't know when there's going to be a 300-point day. You just don't. You're not going to expect it when it happens. It's the same reason why you don't trade economic releases because you're just you got to be safe with your money, guys. And that's what I've been doing wrong, guys. I'm over leveraging. I'm over leveraging, and and those days are over. Um, if it takes me three weeks to get back this three thousand dollars, I don't care. I do not care. If it takes me two months to get back this uh, three thousand dollars, I don't care. Um, I'm not paying for this account anymore, so. What does it matter to me? It's free. It's it's free money. So why would I blow that, guys? I'll I'll trade back from this. Over time, I will get back from this drawdown. Um This is a free account to me now. I paid for it, I've passed, and now it's free. So why am I not taking advantage of that? And using it to its full potential? In any event, guys, I just wanted to get this out there. Um, over leveraging will end you, believe me. And you think that whatever you're using, even one mini NASDAQ, I promise you that can be over leveraging, like way over leveraging. You should probably be on one, two, three micros. This thing can move a lot, guys. The futures market, any of them, crude oil, the E mini S&P 500, but especially the NASDAQ well, and crude oil too. They can move a lot. And you don't always know when it's going to do it. So I'm talking to you right there. What you think is over leveraging, I promise you, you need to go way lower than that. And the micro NASDAQ and the micro crude oil and micro ES should be your best friend. Okay. The small time day trader, those micros, there's a reason why the CME offers them. And you should take advantage of them. The CME introduced them for that very purpose, for the small time day trader. So in any event, guys, I'm done with the mini. You're going to see me on the micro NASDAQ, and uh, I'm sorry that I, I put out. I'm just frustrated with myself, but in any event, guys, uh, I'm not blowing this account. Um, I will milk this bitch for every $1,500, like every dime of that $1,500 I got left. Believe me, I will milk it to its death. Um, I will get back from this. Uh, give me enough time, and I will. Enough time, enough patience. I will get back from this. Trading very small, micro NASDAQ. I'm done with the mini. I'm done gambling. I promise you, I swear to the Lord above, the good Lord Christ, I'm done gambling. 
So I get no high from gambling anymore. None. I'm disgusted by gambling. I'm disgusted. Like it it I, I'm about to vomit. So in any event, I'm sorry. I know that this video is going to get dislikes. I know that, that many of you are going to be like, this dude is nuts. I'm just speaking from the heart, and you can take it or leave it. Bye-bye.